Thank you for purchasing an M-Series audio interface from Motu. Let's take a look at what comes inside the box. In the box, you'll find the M-Series interface and a USB cable to connect the interface to your computer. On the inside of the box lid, you'll find quick setup instructions. The serial number for your M-Series can be found on the bottom of your unit and on the side of the box. You'll need the serial number to register the unit and download optional software, instruments, and loops. For details about how to get these free included assets, watch the next video in this series. Before you get started with your M-Series unit, you'll need to install the M-Series driver and control panel on your PC. The download link is right below this video. It is best to install the driver before connecting the M-Series unit to your PC. After the download completes, find the Motu M-Series installer.exe file in your downloads location. Double click it to start the installation. Once you're in the installer, click Next, Accept, and Install. After it completes, restart your PC. Once the computer restarts, connect your M-Series interface with the supplied USB cable. If your PC has USB-C ports, use an adapter or a USB cable with C connectors on both ends. If you have an M6 and are connecting it to a USB Type-A host, also connect the included DC power adapter. Switch on your interface. After the interface powers on, right-click on the speaker icon in the bottom right corner of your desktop, choose Sounds, and navigate to the Playback Devices tab. Highlight your M-Series and choose Set as Default Device. Connect a pair of speakers or headphones to the unit. Remember, turn the volume knob down at first so you don't damage your equipment or blast your ears. Now, try opening Windows Media Player, YouTube, Spotify, or another music source on your computer. When you hit play, you should now hear the music from the speakers or headphones connected to your M-Series unit. If you don't hear anything, open the M-Series control panel and set the sample rate to 44.1 kHz and try again. You can also use the M-Series control panel to change buffer size, which will be discussed in the upcoming videos. You're now ready to go. Please watch the next video in this series to get the most out of your Motu M-Series interface. Thanks for watching.